Hey guys, Peter Gantner here with another video where for our tokenomics. Uh, before we jump right into the video, I do want to let you know I am not a financial advisor, never want to be a financial advisor, and will never be a financial advisor. Um, but what I want to do is help walk you through being able to do your own research on different projects and different cryptos. And the one we are going to cover today is one of the, what I believe, has the potential to be one of the top ecosystems in all of um, all of cryptocurrency. I believe it's going to be one of the main blockchains, and that is Polkadot. Its native token is DOT, um, and we're going to jump in. And guys, I'm going to share so much information with you uh, today. You are going to see why I have the belief that this can be one of the main. So let's go out to Coin Market Cap. Um, I'm going to back up here real quick because I'd like to show you. DOT is one of the top 10 cryptocurrencies. As you can see, right now it is number seven with a $40 billion market cap at $43.15 per token. Let's jump right into that. Um, incredible volume on the day, guys. $2.6 billion a day in volume that's taking place. It's got a circulating um, supply of $930 million with a total supply of $1 billion 66 million um of course we can jump right in to um where can you purchase if you want to do that um we can scroll down here and guys dot is available just about on every platform out there uh binance kraken it's also available on gate matter of fact if you do not have a gate account and you do want to purchase it we would appreciate if you click on our affiliate link that will be attached to this video in the notes. It helps support the channel and helps us continue to create uh, great content. Also, if you love this content, hit the subscribe button, ring the bell, and they'll let you know when we have more coming on. Of course, we've talked about this, and this is really um, almost on every exchange. There's large uh, volume going on. Remember, you only want to use ones that have high volume because then you'll be able to get in and out of the token easily, all right, when that time comes if you decide to do that. Um, so real quick, guys, let's jump out to their website. I already have a lot of these pulled up. Um, you can go out and visit the Polkadot website um, and learn about it. There's the light paper, there's the white paper, and of course, there's Wiki. You have their Twitter page here. You have their GitHub, all right? But uh, let's jump on to about. Um, so we're going to start digging into why I have so much confidence in this project. Um, when you get to the about page, guys, you can scroll down to the bottom here. And you can see the three founders of uh, Polkadot. Uh, you've got Gavin Wood there in the middle. Um, he is one of the original founders of um, Ethereum. Um, he also uh, coined the uh, term Web 3.0, and he serves as president of the Web 3 Foundation. If you don't know what the Web 3 Foundation is, you can check that out. Guys, they are funding a lot of the development in the blockchain space. Uh, you also have Peter and you have Robert here. You guys can read all about them. They are both, or all three, are major players in this space, and they've been in the space for a long time doing amazing things. And it seems like everything they touch turns to gold, and that includes polka dot, right? Because of the stuff that they're doing. So, where are some other resources? Of course, you can jump out here and go out to the polka dot YouTube channel. Um, there are a ton of videos here um, that you can check out and look at. Uh, you can visit them on Discord. Um, here is their Twitter account. You can jump on out to from here and check out what they've got going on Twitter or some news. Um, and we're going to get into a lot more details here, guys. Um, about 5,300 people on the Polkadot Twitter page. Uh, they do not use it as much. As a matter of fact, I'm going to hit the follow button here. Um, it is one of the areas where I'm not following on because I usually go to other areas. Um, you can come in. One of the things I love about Twitter is the suggested ones here. You can get a lot of stuff. So you've got Polkadot News here. You can jump out there. It's got 23.9K followers. Um, you can go down and look into their news. There are a lot of sites, guys, that are taking um, uh, um, a, um, a direct or a, um, a targeted approach. Um, so they've developed these sites that have a lot of information on it about the different projects. 
Um, so you can come here and get a snapshot of the news. So you've got polka.news news there that you can come and check out. They've got quite a few followers as well. You have polka daily, uh, not as many followers yet, but guys, they've got some great information that they're putting out here. Uh, you can look here. Um, this is the top winners in price last 24 hours on Polkadot. And they put these out every single day. One of the things that I like to do here is I like to see how much this is changing and to see where the development is. And you can see where the focus is of the different projects. Um, here's another one. Weekly review on Polkadot. You can come down and here's another one. DAP projects on Polkadot. So you can see who are who's developing projects that are being used by the public remember at the end of the day the projects that are going to survive the projects that are going to be able to produce um results are the ones that are creating value for people in the marketplace um, because that's the ones that are going to generate the revenue not just the hype so it's going to go through and show you some of their other projects but there is so much great information. These are the ones that I love, though. Polkadot projects um, reached uh, all-time highs recently. So you can check out and see which are the projects that are having success in the marketplace. So you've got Link and um, Energy Web Token. Um, and this goes on and on. So we're going to let's close that down. And again, you can just keep going down the page and you can see all kinds of charts, all kinds of information that's here. All right. The next thing you can do, of course, is jump out here to ProcaProjects.com. This is going to give you a list of all the different projects that are on Polkadot. As a matter of fact, you come over here, you've got 421, the ones that are substrate based, 138, tooling 33. So you can go through the uh, wallet 39, um, but you can start here and look at the development activity over the last 30 days. What projects are people actually working on? What are making the most progress? Of course, you got Polkadot and Kusama. Kusama is the test net for Polkadot. So things go on Kusama first, they get tested there, and then they go over to Polkadot. Um, you've got Akala, a lot of stuff going on there, 57 activities uh, going on right there, activity developments. You've got Chainx. Guys, I am a, a decent size holder of Chainx. It is uh, one of the projects that I like a lot in this space. Um, they have 49 activities. It is at $13.23. One of the reasons why I like it is it is one of the lower ca market cap um, tokens that are out there. So I believe has a chance for a high return. Um, and then we come down here to Darwinia. Uh, this is an interesting one, guys. Um, it's uh, 201 activities. They just came out with a new crypto, which is Ring. I want to click on this here. Um, Darwinian is a, uh, a Darwinia is one. This token actually just launched in the last few days, their Ring token. But they also have another native token. Let's jump over here and open this up. You've got the uh, Darwinia Commitment Token, which is Katon. Love this, guys. You look at the price, you go $194 a token. Oh, my goodness. But let's jump down here and see that there is only a total supply of about 70,927 of their tokens, about 43,000 in circulating supply with a market cap of only $8.5 million, guys, a fully diluted of only $13 million. Now, remember, if we go back to the projects, it is one of the most active projects in the list, right? Of the, uh, in, the, in the last 30 days, it is one of the most active projects. Now, they just recently did a new token uh, that goes along with their ecosystem that they're building building and that is ring um this actually just launched guys uh, this token has just been made available it is 19 cents it has a much higher circulating and um and max supply 10 billion max supply and of course well total supply of 2 billion max supply would be 10 billion um and it has a circulating supply of 470 million tokens it already has a market cap of about 89 million dollars um, now, remember, these work in concert with each other between these two tokens. 
I do not right now hold any ring. I will be purchasing some, uh, but I do hold the Katon token here in this space. Uh, so let's jump back out here. Guys, there is so much on Polkadot uh, that we could probably spend, uh, you know, seven hours talking about it. You've got the parachains coming, um, getting involved with those. A lot of these tokens here you can stake. I currently have my chain X staked right now and I'm earning additional uh, chain X. Um, if you're looking at chain X, they're getting ready to do Sherpa X, which means you'll get a, um, a, uh, an airdrop if you hold chain X. Uh, that's going to be coming up here um, once the Kusama parachain start. Um, again, I don't want to keep to make this video 10 hours long because there's just so much that you can talk about. You can actually jump out to YouTube as well. Uh, remember, they have the Polkadot YouTube channel, which are videos that are made by them, interviews and stuff. But also, um, you have um, a channel that really focuses a lot on it, which is Crypto's Chain. Um, he does a lot of videos on ChainX and on a lot of the different projects. So that his main focus is the Polkadot um, ecosystem. So you can check that out as well um, in that um, situation. So guys, you can see um, major, major players in the space to help develop this. As a matter of fact, some of them for, and um, Gavin has stated that the reason for him formulating Polkadot was to fulfill the promises of Ethereum um, and build it right from the start. So they learned a lot when they were building Ethereum and they went out and started um, Polkadot um, to uh, be able to fulfill that. So there's a lot more information on it, guys. Could probably talk for days, months even about it, all the different projects that they're working on. So if you jump out here right now, guys, there are a total of 421 different projects. I believe other than Ethereum, this has the most projects that are happening on the system. And remember, the main net has not even launched yet. Um, so I can't even imagine what would happen with the main net uh, once that gets launched and once that gets going. Um, of course, you can come here if you want to look beyond the top 10 of what are the most active projects doing the most. Uh, but remember, guys, this is just a starting point. If you come here and you look and you click on it, um, and let's say ChainX, a lot of activity ha happening on ChainX. Uh, what you may want to do, though, or and, and you probably want to do is jump out and go look at their other stuff. So this is just a great place to get started. You've got refinance here. You've got uh, Fala Network. Um, you've got so many of these. Uh, remember uh, Crust here. If you went back to um, some of the Twitter pages, I believe it's this one right here, you'll start to see that a lot of these are showing up on the ones that are having the most movement. So um, uh, top 10 gainers right here. Let's click on that. And the good thing is, guys, you can go see day after day after day. So this is Click as one of their top uh, gainers for this day. Uh, Ken, which I've actually, I'll have to check out that one out. Uh, it's not one that I've seen on the list um, but they have the date here. So, and they put these out every day. So you can see what is changing on this list and what is staying consistent on it. You can see the partnerships that they're going in. Let's see if we can jump down here and see, oh, here we go. This is the one from the 13th. So you can take the one from the 14th and the one from the 13th, and you can compare and see what's going on here to see what changes. So click was one that was on the 14th and it's again on the 13th. So you can see some consistency here on where the focus is and what is going on. Anyway, guys, that is my video for now. Um, there is so much more. I What we'll end up doing is um, doing some specific videos on some of these projects. So we'll do one on ChainX. We'll do one on some of the other projects so we can really dig in deep onto it. Um, but that was just a quick overview. Make sure you do your homework. Remember, not a financial advisor. If you like the content that you're getting here and if this is you believe is going to help you in uh, your decision making and figuring out um, you know, more about these tokens and coins, um, please hit the subscribe button and support our channel and also ring that bell so you get notified when we come out with more content. Uh, thank you for joining us and have a fantastic week, month, year. Remember, guys, it is altcoin season. Uh, the crypto market is cranking away. There's so much going on um, that having uh, additional resources to help figure that out 
is absolutely imperative to make this a successful journey for each and every one of us. Very good. Thank you. Why me do my two-step?